miss you more. Sincerely, Bridget, it's pretty long in me, more in you. Hello, my name is Madison Warren Fox, and I'm an eighth grader, and I attend Cloverdale Middle School. In Colorado Middle School, in the aerospace class, we've learned so many things. For example, we've learned that building a bridge is way harder than it looks. Also, we've learned how to take something from our imagination, plan it on paper, and then having it in our mind. When inquiring my peers on what the biggest problems were, I found that they didn't like doing the paperwork. Also, our second issue was that we had no idea of what we were doing. We had no prior knowledge on how structural engineering works. So then, the task at hand was to make it seem as if a four-year-old did not make it. <laughs> our, our main goal is to, by the end of the year, build a fully functioning planet rover. We began by building bridges made out of popsicle sticks and then testing the torsion and the weight resistance. After this, we moved on to building wooden chassis, which is like a model for a rover made out of wood and on a 1 to 10 scale size. We are halfway done testing them. We're testing torsion and weight resistance. When we are done, we hope to build a rover that works, that moves, and that a person can fit inside. Throughout the year, we've had various challenges that test the way we think and the way we problem solve. <coughs> we hope that along the path, we will pick up more knowledge, more maturity, and we will, success, we will succeed in our goals. My name is Cecilia Bridges, and this is my views on aerospace. And last semester in aerospace, we built bridges. In this experiment, we need to see which bridge lasts longer underway. To test the bridges, we use sand. We tie the bucket to the bridge and then put sand in the buckets. We put more and more sand in the bucket until the bridges collapse. This helped us learn that when we build structures, that they have to be strong. A vehicle is like a bridge, a frame between two wheels. Hello, my name is Brittany Long, and this is my aerospace experience. Being in aerospace has been an amazing experience for me. In class, we are learning, we are now working on astronaut movers. My class has finished the first three models, finished the first of the three models of our astronaut movers, and we are now testing them. We are testing the, we are testing the movers the same way we tested the bridges. When building the movers, we have to do a lot of measuring of different objects to know what size to make the mover. Although the work is still hard, although the work is hard, I still love this class. And this is 10 things aerospace has taught me. One, a triangle is one of the strongest shapes and commonly used in bridges, buildings, and work. Two, I learned how geometric shapes are used. Three, I, I've learned how to be a better leader by working with younger students. And I also learned about leadership. And five, I learned how to build a structure strong enough to hold a bucket of sand. Number six, how to persevere through tough situations and work together to finish the job. Number seven, how to budget your job and stay within it. Complete precious orders and manage your bank account. Number eight, how to compete taxes and deal with the pain of it. <laughs> <laughs> number nine, how to materially use effects of how you build. And number 10, how to engineer a dream into a real 3D object. Next steps. The next steps for the project is to construct two models out of the PPC <laughs> Welding rod that is the scale of the PVC pipe. The full size rope is to be built. After completing the model, the student will begin to research electrical engineering principles to design a 12 volt electrical system utilizing solar energy. The students will then utilize the knowledge gained to build a powered full size model, Astro Mover, that will be able to negotiate obstacles in predetermined course. Or sand until the thing breaks. Mm -hmm. Do not think so. 
it, it, no, because it's supposed to be solid back here, so I'm stabilizing it. Yeah. <laughs> 